Welcome to Getting Started with Loftware Nice Label Cloud. In this video, you'll learn how to manage your access roles and permissions. You've activated your account and added your first users. Now you can manage your user access roles and permissions in Nice Label Control Center to keep your label printing environment secure. In this video, you'll learn about relationships between users, access roles, and role permissions, creating new access roles and setting new role permissions, and assigning access roles you create to your new and existing users. Each of your Nice Label Cloud users needs at least one access role, and each access role has its own set of permissions. Access roles and permissions help you keep your information accurate and help you keep your printing environment secure and compliant with regulations. Start by opening Control Center. Go to Users Access Roles to see your default access roles. Default access roles have well-balanced permission sets that work in most printing environments without additional configuration. You can't delete default access roles, but you can change their permissions or create new roles as needed. The administration role includes all permissions and is the only role you can't change at all. You always need at least one user in the administration role. By default, the administration role goes to the user who activates your account. If you need more help getting started, you can also use our service provider access role to invite your Loftware partner or sales representative to your Nice Label Cloud account for ongoing support and maintenance. Click through your permissions tab to review permissions for each role or modify default roles to meet your needs. If you need additional access roles, you can duplicate an existing role or create a new role from scratch. For example, you may need a new role with limited permissions for an intern or other short-term worker. To create a new access role, first click Add. Your access role configuration page opens for editing. Under Settings, type your role name and description. Make sure you can easily tell them from other roles to stay organized. Set your role's status. Keep the toggle active so your new role is available immediately. Note that default access roles are always active you can only change the statuses of roles you create yourself. Now you set your role permissions. Your intern's job includes designing and printing labels from one folder in your Control Center document storage. Under Permissions for this role, click Documents. Navigate to Custom Document Permissions. You can assign a specific folder in Documents to your new access role that contains assignments for them to complete. Find the folder you want and click Customize. New access roles have no folder permissions until you assign them. For security, you can make sure they can only access the folders they need for their work. Enable storage permissions so your intern can read, create, update, and delete assignments only in this folder. Go back to your Permissions tab to assign additional permissions. Under General, give your intern access to Designer so they can work on label designs and under Printers, allow them to manage print queues so they can monitor their progress. If you haven't invited your intern to Nice Label Cloud, save your new access role and invite your intern. For more help, watch our Adding Users to Nice Label Cloud video. If your intern is already added in Control Center, you can assign your new access role immediately. Under Users in this role, click Add to search for your new user and add them to your role. Once you save your changes, be sure to remove your user from previous roles when you do reassigning. Go to Users and click the user you want to edit. Right now your intern is a member of both Operator and Intern access roles. But you don't need your intern to have all the permissions of an operator. Select the access role, click Remove, and then click Save. Now your intern in this role has the permissions they need to open and print labels in Designer from their assigned folder. If they need different permissions later, you can always go back and edit your access role. That's it. Thanks for watching. Check out our other videos to learn how Nice Label Cloud helps you do more, faster, with less.